Hello everybody, welcome back to the show. You may recognize this game as a game I played on what I was calling Demo Days. Well, interesting twist. I, I didn't love the game nor hate the game. I thought it seemed very interesting for what it was. It looked like it had kind of a, a, a story that was going to kind of go somewhere, but it was sort of a little unplayable. I kept hitting some bugs and it was very clearly a short demo. And there's nothing necessarily wrong with that, all, all that information by itself. And I thought, maybe it's for me, maybe it's not. I think I ended up putting it in the list of we'll check out again in the future. And, and in fact, there was one very specific bug that happened where I said, <laughs> I, I don't know my exact words from the video, I could look it up, but I'm not going to where I said something like, I wish the developers would see this because I'm so bad about making bug reports. And I just really feel like as early in development as this is, that this, this would be really useful information for them. Admitting my own laziness, <laughs> but again, identifying what I thought might happen. Get this, what, guess, what, guess what happened? Guess what happened? A few dragons, the developer of the game literally posted like two days after I posted my video to YouTube. They said, thanks for playing. They said full screen window is the only way to play. I made that comment about one of the options. I think every game should have that option. We just released a demo with many new features. You played a few days too early. Like literally I missed it by like two days. I went and checked the update log. It was like two days. We have healing and a few other things in it now. It was super entertaining to watch you play. Uh, flattery, I guess. I don't know. I, 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 when people say nice things, I mean, it's nice. But I guess I, I could have skipped that. Sorry, I wasn't screening that. The bug where you got stuck at the start is actually fixed now. So it took way, uh, way too long for us to see what happened. Hope you're able to give it another chance at some point. And if not, we're still happy you played. My reply was... Absolutely, I'm going to get another chance. It's just about a matter of fitting in my schedule. So here we go. This is the Sacred Acorn updated demo. What's it say down in the corner? Version 0.8.8. Let's give it another shot. I have no, um, I have no preconceived notions about if it'll be a lot better or a lot worse. I played it for about 10 minutes before, and I kind of got the general idea. So I believe we're playing with the controller, and uh, let's just get started. Right, it's not quite Demo Day 2.0, but we, we're definitely going to try this demo. So let's do it. Uh, let's just double check the options because because it's a demo. I, I think like I had uninstalled full screen window. That's great. We'll do sound music, everything all the way. Let's give it a show game time. OK. I'm going to play for like 10, 15 minutes. Uh, you know, I'm, I, I don't know that I'll even finish the demo, but I don't know. We might as well show game time. <laughs> so it says resume, but it's 0.0%. .0 That's interesting. Huh? I don't know. Oh, let's see. Similar to what I remember. The Elders have always been here. Guardians of the sacred essence. They shaped the land and gave us life. And we gave tribute to the Elders as thanks for the gifts to us. And trans... That was a little fast for me. <laughs> Until... I felt like I was reading at a pretty normal speed. <laughs> Boom! Some kind of corruption. Some kind of evil. The last, I don't know, bit of hope or energy of sacred acornness gets shot into this one. I don't know, something like that. Alright, let's check out the pause menu. Abilities dash allows you to dodge. I think that's in the game. <laughs> so... Uh, full transparency here. I grew up 
in a forest environment for many years. Lived lived like actually in a forest at one point. Um, and yeah, there's all kinds of crazy noises like that. Okay, so yeah, three combo attack. I'm just trying the different buttons, see what they all do. Okay, so far that's the only button I have. I think this intro is a little different. This is definitely the kind of game where I want to attack every single bush and see where the secret is, but for the purpose of the demo, I probably won't. <laughs> this reminds me a little bit of, like, Evo Land. It's like, oh, there's gonna be something there. Yeah, this controller is still kind of sticky. Very annoyed at my controller. Oh, this is the heel! Heal one orb of your health. The, the developer, like I said, they mentioned they added heals to the game. For me, uh, just playing like the first 10 minutes or so, I was a little surprised that there wasn't a heal. Heal one orb of your health, charge for a small amount of time to convert essence into health. Oh. I don't know how to use essence, but... It sounds like, as long as you're not in the middle of a fight, you might be able to do that conversion. I'm getting a little bit of screen ripple. You know what? It doesn't seem like it's coming through on OBS. But I'm seeing it. I wonder if that's a like a V-Sync thing? Um, video? Is it here, maybe? I don't know. Maybe that screen shake. Let's turn off screen shake and see if that's it. It also could be that the game is still such an early development that it's not fully optimized. Or it could be my system. It could be a million things. But one of the things I said to the developer is I was like, I can't imagine how hard it is to make a game. All the different things you have to do. Okay. Uh, I don't... Eva, there you are. What are you doing all the way out here? Did you get lost again? Something is wrong with the great tree, Tuska. And the other animals <laughs> we share the emerald thicket with seem different. Some even tried to attack me. You need to come back to the tribe and talk to old Milu. Milu? Surely she will know what to do. The way ahead is blocked, though. You need to find five acorns to open the way to the burrows where Milu will end the tribe is. Hurry! All right, so I need to find five acorns. Prediction. Prediction. I think the demo is probably five, find, uh, find five acorns. Prediction. Tell me if I'm right. Tell me if I'm wrong. Okay, so I think this... This is all the same so far, so this... Oh. That's different. Wow, it took off a whole health orb. Left button to heal. And that's my essence. Wow, that took off a whole orb. I'm guessing that was like, here, we're gonna show you how to heal. But, man, that's rough. I didn't have a choice. Oh yeah, we gotta break through the other side. Okay, so this is the same. I'm pretty sure these spikes are new, but they have to show you how to heal. Voice of the Force. Some things can only be broken from one side. Look for a weak spot. The squirrel sounded like the deep voice. The forest has the whitey voice. I really need a new controller. Yeah, I know. Obviously, obviously I realized what the game was trying to tell me, but I just wasn't paying attention. All right. I wasn't paying attention. All right, now we're gonna get crab attacked. Boom! <laughs> you see how you see how my character turns around? That's a controller problem. Oh, okay. Okay, a few dragons. I I mentioned the game was kind of hard, and they were like, "We're gonna add a substantial amount of enemies." All right, now I gotta heal. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, we'll burrow for acorns. Oh, I have five acorns. Is that it? Just these guys hit so hard. Give me that Ethens. Ethens? Essence is the word I was going for. I've been a little tired lately. <laughs> See, if I, if I had a better controller, this wouldn't be as much of an issue. But do you notice how I walk up to him and then my character turns around? Oh, wrecked! It's my controller, I'm telling you. The way has opened, so I didn't need to do that, but at that point I was just annoyed. Okay, I've officially gone farther than the previous demo, because that's where I got stuck. I'm gonna go around this person, I don't have enough health. Oh, never mind. Ooh, spit my five acorns. Okay, um, crazy slugs are after me. Health orb. Yes! So healthy! Uh, if I go over that, it will kill me, so... I'm not sure what to do. <laughs> Alright! I see the improvements they made. Unfortunately for me, I'm, I'm still using this controller. I guess I could use keyboard and mouse, but... Man, I really don't want to. This is, like, such a controller game. I don't even know how to attack on keyboard. But that that's not that's not the developer's fault. Oh. Oh. The map stones can help guide you in your journey across. Whatever the name of this place is. See, they show we're in the burrows right now. That's kind of cool. How do I how do I access it again? <laughs> zoom zoom and enhance. Alright. I don't know how to access it. Oh, no. That was Villa again. Villa? Could be. Who knows? Um, so, I don't... I, the concept of a map stone? Cool. I don't know how to access it one more time. <laughs> so this is the little home area. Oh, nice. Ema, you're back. I was beginning to worry. Wait, I sent something within you is dew bright. Ah, ah, you felt something you strange that? wake up from a nap? You felt something strange wake you from a nap. There we go. There we go. Reading. Just getting over a cold. <laughs> this is worrying and can't be a coincidence. I fear we're all in grave danger. The great tree Tusaka has been cursed and the chaos is inflicting our thicket. Thicket is such a fun word. Ah. Without Tusaka's magic protecting us, the thicket will be consumed by chaos and shall slowly fall apart. Our home will be lost. Ah. Ah. We need you to investigate what has brought this here and stop the chaos from spreading any further. Ah. But first, ah. rest. Oh, rest at your burrow while you while we clear a path for you. You will need your strength for the challenges ahead. That sounds exciting. Does that mean I can sleep? Okay. Oh, I can take a rest. Full heal, absolutely. That'd be wild if there was sleeping without a heal. No boss. Hmm. I can't put my paw on it, but something is different about you. Thanks. Alright, so that area is locked, obviously. Hmm. So did they clear a path? I guess I should have checked before I took the nap if they cleared a path. But it's fine. That was Nima. Or like Nima Toad. Oh, Nima Squirrel. Never mind. I guess I've only ever known tree squirrels. I haven't. I don't know any squirrels that have burrows. I guess ground squirrels is what we call them, but I, I don't really know. Hmm. It's time for you to see what's happening in our thicket. I'll await your return. Okay. 
that. Tell me about the thicket. I skipped all those enemies, so they're still all there and corrupted. <laughs> oh! What's this? Learn Essence Blast? Did I learn that from you, or is it just sitting on the forest? Who put you in the cage? This is where we all hang out. Or how does one use the Essence Blast? X... Uh, B... Oh, there it is! Oh, wow, I use a considerable amount of my Essence. That's enough to, like, heal a whole orb, so Essence Blast is... Probably not your everyday weapon. Oh, do we have a little puzzle? Do we? Well, I don't want to use my essence blast. It ricochets. That's fun. <laughs> um, yeah, maybe we come back here. Maybe this is not a puzzle for us yet. Hmm, okay. Well, I'm almost out of essence, so... Moss, can you open the gate? How do I actually get out? Oh, is it just down here? Oh, it's just the back back the way I came. It's just that easy. <laughs> well, no, is it? Because then what's... that? Ah. If it's back the way I came, what else is over here? You know what I mean? Because it's just the starting area all over again. Hmm. Yeah, I think... I think I don't understand. Well, let's test... Um, let's test the Essence Blast versus an enemy. Because I want to know how good they are. I mean, that's the point of a demo, right? Figure things out? Alright, come here... Rabby dude. Well, off to a bad start. Oh, no way! For how much essence that takes, you should be able to one-shot these guys. Because these guys only take three hits. Oh, these guys only take one hit. That's nice. Okay, so... If I'm just kind of estimating, generally, it seems that the Essence Blast does about one attack worth. Is that is that right? So the Essence Blast is, is not a full game changer. Oh, Mapstone is back. There we go. See, now I know where to go. You go south. I don't know why the Mapstone wasn't working before, but yes, in hindsight, it was very obvious that I go south. <laughs> Mushroom friend? This would probably be an excellent use for the essence blast that I that I wasted. Oh boy, okay. Wow, no joke. Alright, I'm currently using the D-pad, which feels very unnatural, but it's gonna allow me uh, to not get the weird other problems that I've have been having. Whoa, the range on him! Did you see that? I don't think I actually took four shots, so maybe I'm wrong about how much the acorn blast does. I feel, honestly, I feel bad for the mushrooms. Okay. So, that means something's here. Oh, a cave! Okay. Mush? Plume Caves? Is that what that said? I'm, I'm dyslexic, but I think that's what it said. Hmm. Well, this is going to take a while. Dash allows you to dodge some enemy attacks and go through some passable train. Why have I not been dodging? How do I dodge? Oh, sure. 
How do I dodge? Double. Nope. No, shoot. Well, that was a waste. It is fun how it bounces, though. How do I dodge? Is there a controller list? Or dash, rather? Is there a controller list? Hmm. Uh. Well, this is why we played the demo, to figure these things out. Left bumper, right bumper, alt, control. <laughs> Press some keys, Z. No. Hold X. Hmm, I don't know. I truly don't know how to dash in this game. Something better not jump out of the water. You hear me, game? You hear me? Something better not jump out of the water. I have no essence. <gasps> Look at all these acorns. Yes, please. Oh, this is a shrine. The offering welcome. Chushaka gives life. Well, used to. Well, now what? I would like some of the acorns, please. That's it. Oh, I'm betting those do damage. That's fun. Oh, well. Oops. I'm so gonna die. And I've, like... I've gone basically nowhere. I keep staying on the path for some reason. There is there is no need for this path. Are you a good thing? You are a good thing. I figured it was a good thing. Wait, can I... Can I take out all these mushrooms and get their essence? Do I want to take their essence? Is that a good thing? Is that a bad thing? Am I a bad guy? Am I a good guy? I don't know. I'm the protagonist in a video game, so I'm probably somewhat morally bankrupt. Nope. Okay. Let's... You know what? I'm gonna heal now, just because I'm very nervous, because everything does, like, one damage. This is that same symbol that was back at home base. Does that mean it does something? Oh, now the game's giving me energy. That's what's up. Okay, dead end cave. This seems like essentially just like a bonus area. Not just a bonus area. I refilled all of my essence. I should have healed and then looted that last bit, but that's okay. okay I don't need to take this guy out. Oh, roller. Can I get three hits off? That was just a test. It is possible. I don't know how much damage that last hit does, you know? Like, is it... Is executing the combo worth it? Like, is it like seven normal hits or... You know... Two big hits. Another map stone. I uh, like how frequent the map stones are. So that was the bonus area I just went to, right? Was there a... A crown king there. It was not an enemy, but it was just like... Oh, but once you do the map stone... Look, it's not letting me do it again. So, yeah, get your get your eye full of map stone. Oh, no, now it is back again. So I think I went up there. Or did I go up there? Well, I'm going to double check, because I don't want to miss something. Oh, but I don't want to go through the uh, spiky bits again. You know what, we're just gonna say I went up there and I just don't know if I remember. <laughs> and now we're gonna go up here. Oh! I just messed all of that up. I was like, oh, I'll just go around, look how clever I am. Man, the little guys got me. The little guys are easy. 
Here we go. Did you hear that? Huh? Uh. 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 They're like ghosts. There's like little ghosts come. Okay, that one kind of scared me. Why am I scared now? Because I see ghosts? Uh. Is this a puzzle? Oh no, I'm going crazy. Is this a puzzle? to this? No. Is this a puzzle and I just don't even know? <laughs> I'm trying to look for like symbols and stuff. Those are the same. I don't really, I'm not like really good with sound. Actually, I don't know if I've ever talked about this on stream before. I have I have some pretty severe right side hearing loss. Um, so I always wear earbuds like in that ear, uh, like if I'm out in public or shopping or something, because it's it's just easier to like just essentially cut off the ear and then not have to worry about it. Also, when people notice you're wearing an earbud, they talk to your other ear. <laughs> if this is a pattern, I have lost it. Theoretically, you'd think I'd be able to hit more than one of these at a time. I think? I think I give up. <laughs> I think I give up. Oh no, I have to go, <laughs> I have to go all the way back here again. Alright, well... This is, what I, this is what I get for not taking him out the first time. Ooh. Oh, I thought that one would have got him. So, can I run from the others? Let's do it. Oh, oh, so close. That was so close. It's so close, I'd say it's it's worth trying. Let's heal. I do not want to restart. I don't know where it saves last. In a way, I haven't done very much, though, but... Okay, according to Mapstone... There is something straight up. Oh! Well, that was terrifying. Oh, no! No, I do not like that at all. I don't even know why. I'm necessarily taking these guys out yet, but my theory is if they locked me in, this is a boss fight. So I'm going to want to take out anything that could potentially be in my way. That's, that's, that's just my theory. I wish the essence blast did more damage. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one. So that's seven hits, right? One, two. That's so annoying. I couldn't, because I'm not using the the joystick, I'm using the directional pad, I couldn't quite face him. So one, two, three. Four. Five, six. Seven, eight, nine, nine normal hits, but seven hits if you include the three bonuses or the, the third attack. So does that mean the third attack does the equivalent of two hits of damage? Yeah, that's what I'm going with. Oh, I'm not done yet. We are not done yet. Oh wait, 
this area is not locked. Yeah, it locked down there, and now that's open, and it locked up here. When it's not locked up here. Okay, I'm just, just, just losing it. We're really deep in this cave. Have you seen the shrine? I would love to go see the one it is built after someday, but I can't leave these caves while he is in charge. Um, I did see the shrine. And you do not want to see... You do not want to see what he's up to because now he's evil. Um, against my better judgment, I'm going to attack this thing. Okay, that was not a thing. I'm glad. I actually didn't want to attack it. But this is more me doing the demo. Is this... This is it? We Like, we did the cave? Hmm. Do I have to walk all the way back? Ooh. All right. I'm just going to say something about a feature that I really enjoy in games. And it is definitely a modern game thing. Many people, including me, call it the Skyrim door. Which is you spend <laughs> in Skyrim hours, literal hours, running through a cave. And then you get to the end only to then pop out a door near the exit that essentially, you know, like theoretically you could have gotten to from the entrance if you could just jump a little bit more and it's a convenient way. But check out this map over there. I can't quite get all the way over there out of camera frame. It does look like there's an alternate exit straight down from Musha. So let's try to find that exit. And maybe this game has exactly what I was asking for already built in. So it'd be right about here, right? Or no? I'm not great with maps. Have I mentioned that? Yeah, it would be right about here. What? Okay. All right. I'm just literally going to like, based on the map, it was like a straight, straight down. We're going to go straight down. Oh, I need some more water. Oh, nope. <laughs> Started a <laughs> I was looking away and I just started turning. I don't even know when I started turning. <laughs> All right. Is this like a secret exit? Like you gotta be... Oh. Um. Okay, we've got some greens here. Look, it's 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 dark because it's in the shadow, but there is clearly a bush here. Um, no, not letting me. Well, maybe if I could dash, it allows you to dodge in some passable terrain. Um, no, that's the heal button. Um, okay. Well, I I think I I think I found the other exit, but I don't know how to use it. So that's, it's good that I found it, but if we look at the map stone, it looks like it's just open and there's clearly some kind of bush there. So either I'm doing something wrong or I'm missing something. And now getting back is gonna be a bit of a challenge. <laughs> okay, that, that's actually kind of a fun puzzle. <laughs> I was a little overconfident the first time and not super paying attention. Oh, I'll just go this way. These do anything? No. Oh, this demo is actually quite involved. Oh! I forgot about the, like all the enemies out here. This guy's range is like too much. Too much with that range. It's like a counterintuitive amount of range, if that makes any sense. It might, it might just be complaining, but. Oh. Let's check out this way. Dead end. 
Okay, this demo's got, uh... My prediction was wrong. I got five acorns immediately. The mapstone can help guide you to your future journey across Transira. Oh, missed it. See? They sure were in the burrows right now. Oh, wait. Is that where I just... Did I just get lost? I didn't want to talk to you. Man, I, I keep... Mapstone. There we go. Okay, so I just went down there, and I went to Mushroom Land. Okay. So... Oh, this is blocked off. Oh, cool! A crow? No, that's a raven. That's a raven, folks. I could be wrong. Let me know when they come... I'm gonna die from, like, the little guys. <laughs> Let me know in the comments if that's a, a crow. But I am 80% sure it's a raven. And if that bird was made by an artist that had no bird in mind, also let me know. Have I explored everywhere? No, I haven't been here before. This is new. All right, let's go. Ooh. Their weakness is they're quite slow, but you have to be ready. Okay, I just, I'm using the D-pad. My stupid Microsoft X bodily controller. That doesn't work very good. <laughs> you know what? We've been playing for 30 minutes. That's actually good enough. Um, so thank you to a few dragons for reaching back out to me and saying, hey, try this game again. Because uh, yeah, this game went from, there's clearly something there to, okay, I can see how this could be a lot of fun. So what's, what's gonna have to, like next steps for me is well first of all i have to get a new controller i know i've been saying that for a while i bought a new controller it came i was all excited it was just broken immediately and i had to return it and i'm just like i'm so tired of spending so much money on controllers that just break and i'm tired of plugging it in but now i suspect that's actually my phone's or not my phone but my computer's bluetooth i think my bluetooth chip might not be great because i was having some other issues anyways so I need a new controller. That's neither here nor there, and that's not a sacred acorn's fault. But um, I want to see, like, my first power-up actually feel like a power-up. The first power-up you get in a game, it's just like a normal hit at a distance, but at a cost of essentially a health bubble. So if you figure how I was playing, which is not very good. I'm not very good at this game. I'm not very good at most games. But if you figure how I was playing you would never shoot because the health that you can get is worth so much more in terms of total damage output than your uh, shot can possibly mean. So that's my theory there. The first power up really should feel very strong. Uh, I'd love to know how to do a dash and um, a little bit maybe, mm, you know what? I love the map stones. I'm just gonna call that out right now. I love the map stones. I was gonna say maybe a little more direction of where to go. But I figured it out. I, I was clearly going to a new area, so maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong there. But also, just because it's... I, I'm giving my thoughts because, I don't know, they asked for my thoughts. But um, it doesn't make them right. Because <laughs> sometimes games are better when they're actually harder. And sometimes they're worse when they're harder. But there you go. So, um, yeah. Yeah, definitely from one demo to the next demo, it was a considerably elevated game so let's see the next demo and then um let's pay attention to the release you know and again are we talking uh, a five hour game for me i'd like this to be a three to five hour game that's the kind of game where i feel like i'm on an adventure and i can crank it out in one day and i've accomplished something and it kind of sits with me and it resonates with me and i enjoy it evil land 2 for example is like 30 something hours and by the end it just felt like it was like oh a new area because why not because they wanted a new area and it didn't feel like it was earned at the same time i know it's incredibly difficult to price a game but 
you know, if I'm doing a five hour game, I don't want to pay $30. There are definitely a lot of 30, 40, $50 five hour games. And uh, not for me. So, um, yep, it's on my wish list. I'll keep an eye on it for sure. And uh, I, ho I hope you enjoyed the, the second look at the demo. Just uh, as a reminder, this is version 0 0.8.8. .8. That matters because these people are working on this thing and they're making some changes. <laughs> so that was already a big shift from the first one. So uh, thanks, everybody. See you soon.